Football Cub D, Danny Man here, and welcome back to another episode of Train Sim World. We are going to continue on with the 201D-03 Harrow and Wellston to Elephant Castle. So, in the last episode, we rocked the train up here to the siding. Uh, we shut everything down, and now we are back at the other side, and we need to uh, fire everything back up. So, let's begin. First of all, let's head over here. Uh, gauge lights on. Oh, I can't do that yet. However, I can do this. So we're going to Elephant and Castle. And I need to pop uh, this in here. No, I don't want to go into the driver's seat. I want that. Control key in. Set that to on. Excellent. Do we need lights? Nah, we're good. Uh, we'll stick the... Ooh. Hello. <laughs> there you go. Uh, have some lights there, people. There you go. I'll just jump back in here and ignore that this train is literally chocked full of people. Right, get that into inter. Let's get that brake pressure up. Bring it down to two. And Harold Wilson platform for 05, 40 in 13 seconds. So we've got literally 13 seconds to get that. So that's nice. Right, and switch that off, and off we go. Right, away we go. All is good with the world. Uh, again, as you can see, see these markers? It's it's brought them up again. Let's uh, get rid of them, because they're, they're kind of stupid. I don't know why it keeps bringing them up. So, we want a game. Okay, and we don't want... See, disable junction derail should be off as well. Oh well. Uh, objective marker. Right, switch this off. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, e, apply. And then go back. Okay. Let's continue on. Yeah, so there's a bunch of settings that I always change. And for some reason, the game is just like, nah. I'll, uh, I'll, sw I'll switch everything back, <laughs> which is really annoying. So here we are, here's our glorious train that the people are just rendering in there. Nice. It's pretty full already. Uh, for it, yeah, we're late already. I did spend a wee bit of time messing about there. Well, uh, we'll maybe try and gain it back by overspeeding slightly. Alright, stop that right there, that's fine. Right, get them doors open. Uh, so we're loading passengers. Yeah, we were supposed to be gone pretty much a minute ago. So it's really weird, I think the game needs to, for these scenarios at least, uh, give you more time to get the train set up. I think it just thinks that you're gonna, it's literally gonna take a second to move this key, move that key, change what you want over here, get the brake pressure up, silence the alarm, go. It, yeah, it doesn't take, doesn't take that long if you're quick at it, but it's still, it's, it's nowhere near enough time, even if you do it mega fast. So here's our train heading out. It's a nice day. 26 in the morning. I suppose it would be daylight at this time, in April. So we're basically using the same settings as we used uh, the last time. Alright, so heading out 0.7 of a mile. I'm not sure how long this is going to take. I think it might be like 40 minutes or so to do this entire journey. I might actually get up to uh, 45 miles per hour here. It'd be absolutely astonishing if we did. So track speed limit is 90. Ah, that would be nice. There we go. We're actually at... Okay, we're, we might be speeding slightly. We are going downhill, which helps. Uh, we'll just coast. We are coming into the platform anyway. I'm going to add a touch of braking. Brake. 
breaking one may have been the exact notch of breaking that we needed there. Might be a little bit short. Wet coast. Slow it down again. Two, three, four. Stop, please. Thank you. Okay, get them doors open. And we shall prepare to head off. Oh, yeah. You can hear the wind. Absolutely nobody on the platform. That's great. <laughs> doors are closing up. And we're away again. Speed limit is still 45. Heading to South Kent, and so we're, we're covering a little bit of the journey we did on the way out uh, to Harrow and Wellston the last time, which is fine. What is that? Oh, it's, a, it's a path. I was wondering why that bridge was so incredibly tall. It's just a footbridge. Right, so heading out. No trains on the main line. No trains that I could see on the main line. Oh well. That's sad. <laughs> Uh, 700 yards to go. Yeah, this is it's pretty much all down here, uh, downhill from Harrow and Wellston. It's pretty good. Let's uh, think about slowing down. Uh, this could be pretty perfect. Possibly, maybe. We will take that. That's pretty good, actually. Right, let's get them doors open. Passengers are loading. We're exactly a minute late at this point. Let's get the doors closed. And let's head out. Let's get straight up into three... Uh, half a mile ago, just over half a mile ago, <clears throat> to North Wembley. We'll soon be passing the depot that we exited in the last episode, which will be fine, I would imagine. Nice. Ah, there are a few people on the train. It looks like the mob that was on board departed at Harrow and Wellston. <laughs> Seems weird starting up a train and already having it full of the brim of people. It's slightly odd. Alright, let's get two breaking again. Two breaking seemed to serve us well the last time. Uh, here comes the angry mob now. Probably wondering why the train is a minute late. Uh, this is not going as planned. Come on. Alright, a little short on that one, but we redeemed ourselves in the end there. It's fine. Pop them doors open. I think we're only going to be more late from here. I don't think we're going to make up any more time. And um, let's get going. Wait. What just happened there? Oh, it's there. <laughs> I was going to say that AI train basically disappeared. Oh, buddy. Let's 
see ya. Right, so Wembley Central platform. Next station. Wembley Stadium should be over there somewhere. We can't see it from here. I suppose if I went up. There it is. Way in the distance there. Uh, just a short hop to this one. That's nice. Driving under speed limit. Yeah, because this train uh, can't go over the speed limit. <laughs> it's not fast enough. It's weird that it gives you points for that. Yeah, how we're looking? Well, we're looking okay. All right, let's coast for a section. Fire on them. Their brakes. Yeah, this is looking good, actually. Five yards. I think it was closer than five yards game. <laughs> yeah, so we're still just over a minute late. That's not too bad at all. I'd like to be on time. But to you. All right, let's get going. Signal ahead changes, which is nice. And we are on our way again. Now, we're about to get a reduced speed limit of 40. And it is for going through this tunnel down here. Once we enter the little tunnel, uh, it's going to bring us down to 40. Or it will bring us down to 40 before we actually reach it. I don't think will be at 40 and that short of a distance but we'll keep an eye on it 31 yeah we should be fine although we are going downhill it is picking up speed a lot faster right we'll let it coast for a while possibly going to be speeding a bit that's fine actually it might help us gain back some of the time that we lost then we're going to be going uphill again at 45 miles per hour. There we go. We're still waiting for the back of the train to clear that sign. Once it clears, we'll get the 45. There it is. Again, the train's struggling It make speed going up this incline here. Here we go, Stonebridge Park, where we started our magnificent journey. Just behind us there is Stonebridge Depot. That is, right there. Uh, let's think about slowing down. Got to go three braking for this one. Did we make up any time there? Not really. Yay. Right, open up them their doors. There we go, that's nice. Close the doors again. And we are off. Right, so Huddleston platform, almost a mile. So look going over that whoa that's kinda strange. Again, forty five on the speed limit. Probably not gonna reach forty five, to be honest. Which is unfortunate, but hey ho, it is what it is. Might get to 45. 
There you go. Training grounds on the left hand side there. Yeah, there's a, quite a large yard in there. Alright, let's set to coast and prepare to slow down. Let's go two breaking with this one. Yeah, it's coming down to 30. And 0.6 of a mile. And that's one of the this one looks pretty decent actually. There we go, perfect. Pop open the doors. We're still way behind schedule. Two minutes behind schedule now, almost. I suppose if we didn't have to start the train up at the beginning, we would have been okay. And we are away again. Right, Wolsden Junction, platform one. 5.54 and 18, so, well, well that's chalked already. <laughs> it's already 5.54 and 45. Oh well. And the speed limit is going to come down. Alright, so the 30 miles per hour. 500 yards or so. Three hundred yards. We are going uphill, so I may not have to break here. If I let it coast, gravity should slow us down. There not really any point trying to speed back there because we're just coming straight into the station anyway. Alright, slow us down please. And thank you. Doors open on the right side this time. Miles behind schedule, absolutely miles. Oh well, I think we'll still get a gold for this. We've been pretty good with our stopping distances, etc. Our speed limits. We have been uh, we've broken the speed limit a couple of times, but nothing absolutely major. Right, heading out. Fifteen. Where the hell's that fifteen? We are going straight on here. Right, are we actually entering the tube? I think Queen's Park is the, the station just before entering the actual underground tube. I may be wrong. We are going to get a 45 mile per hour speed limit. Pretty sharpish as well, so that's nice. Right, Kensal Green. And then I think after Kensal Green, it's potentially... Queen's Park, right? If I remember my London tube correctly. Right, there's the 45. So we pass the sign there, but we don't get to increase speed until the back of the train. It goes past the sign. There we go, into the darkness. Yeah, it's literally come up to 45, and then we're going to have to slow down anyway. That sucks. Give me two on the break in. Ah, 
tattoo was maybe a bit severe. Hey, <laughs> right, there we go. Doors are open. Loading passengers. Let's close up them doors. Let's get going. 0 0.8 miles, Queen's Park platform. That's platform two. Is platform two the end of the scenario? I, uh, I don't know. Is it? <laughs> right, 45 mile per hour on the speed limit, that's awesome. There was an invisible wall there that would not let me return back to the train. That was weird. Alright, so there we go. We've got 15 miles per hour coming up pretty sharpish, actually. Oh, that was close. I almost did not notice that, but we're all good. Yeah, I think it's the last station, right? How late are we? 5.59 and 32. So we're about a minute late. Just over a minute. Possibly two minutes by the time we get in here. No idea why there's just a random section of rail that leads to insta death. Seems odd. Perfect. Doors to the left hand side unlocked. Close them back up. Objective complete. Kilburn Park Platform 2. Alright, so we're continuing on. I think this potentially is a full length route, right? So this train is not in service. Yeah, so we are literally heading into the darkness. Awesome. 35 miles per hour through the actual tube. That's fine. I think 35 is like our max speed. Oh, my light's on. They are on, it's just dark. <laughs> Uh, so we're basically just keeping an eye on this. There we go, back in the tube. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Now that downhill gradient really ran away there. I'm gonna go six on the break in for this. Light coast for a spell. Perfect. Right, get them doors open. Get the brake pressure back up. We are miles late. <laughs> brake pressure is back up. 
And off we go again. Next stop, Maidvale. Uh, 30 speed limit change and 800 yards. So that is beyond the next station, so that's fine. Go running smoothly, prepare to slow down. Yeah, it seems to slow down way faster when it's actually in the tube. Perfect. Perfect ish. We're still mega late. As always seems to be the case. Alright, close up the doors. And away we go. Light changes to green. Warwick Avenue, platform 2. But 064 and 48. So we've already missed that. So oh well, <laughs> uh, 30 miles per hour on the speed limit. Uh, we're going to be speeding slightly. We're going to get a 35 mile per hour speed limit change. Fifty yards. There's no point actually increasing the speed though, because we're just gonna have to slow down again. Came in a little hot there, it's all good though. I've tried to save some time by coming in quicker. Alright, let's get the doors closed. Okay, next stop Paddington Platform 4. So we've got 25 mile per hour speed limit change just before we, looks like it's literally just as we enter out of the tube into Paddington platform. I think if I remember correctly, this one's got quite a steep curve on it as you, uh, as you come through the station. If it is this one, it might be another, it could be another completely different platform altogether. All right, let's set that up on coast. Uh, we shall prepare to come down to 25. Let's start slowing down now, actually. Hundred yards to go on that. Yeah, I think we're doing okay. Yeah, it is. Just as you come through here, it comes down to 25. Okay. Duly noted. Right, perfect, right, get them doors open. We're still miles behind schedule, but it's okay. 
wait for the passengers to board and then off to our next area. Close up them doors. Get into that. And let's go. 20. Okay. That's fine. It's gonna come up to thirty-five couple of couple of yards. There we go. There was the thirty-five sign there at the bottom right. And we are free to go. Edgeware Road platform two. Three hundred yards away, this is a real short hop. There we go. Leave it in coast. Start breaking soon. Oh, that person just disappeared into the shadow realm. Open up them doors. If we had time, you could run out and fix these monitors. However, we don't, so we're not going to. Right. Let's close up the doors again. And let's start heading out. Let's get into the off and release. And away we go. 13 yards, 25 miles per hour. Okay. I can literally see the next platform. It's, it's right there. platform. We're heading for Elephant and Castle, right? and castle even the board shows that we're late as hell oh well it is what it is right fire the doors open close up them doors now set to off and release and away we go right Baker Street Platform 8, 06 and 11. 11 minutes past 6, which it's now. Ah, uh, we're kinda making up time. Kinda. Now yeah, we're going 1 mile per hour over the speed limit. That's not that bad. In the grand scheme of things. Alright, 100 yards. I'm going to give it two break in. Uh, two break in at 100 yards seems pretty fine. making up the time. Almost. We're not going to finish this route on time. No way. But... We're getting there. 25 miles per hour. God. Ah, but there's a 30 mile per hour increase. Oh my god, it's so dark in here. I probably should have my cab lights on for going through here. 
but uh, hey ho. Right, there's the 30 mile per hour. I will take it. Regent's Park Platform 2. Which is over there somewhere. Uh, cab lights. There we go. In fact, that looks absolutely horrific. I'm going to switch them off at the next earliest convenience. I much preferred it in the darkness. Alright, stop please and thank you. Get the doors open. Yeah, that's fine. It's, they're much better being off, I think. I think it looks better being off. <laughs> okay, let's head out. Oxford Circus, platform three. 6, 15 and 18. This is the first time in ages that I've actually left a platform and I've not already been late for uh, where it is I need to go. <laughs> Which is absolutely astonishing. Right, there we go. Slowing down for that 25. There's the sign. The board is right there. So, uh, it's kind of creepy because I've actually got no idea. Which way. We're just getting sort of thrown around here. In the tube. Can't tell if it's going left or right. Right, bring it down now. Let it coast. There's no one here because the train is so late. That's understandable. Fine. Right, loaded passengers. Still a minute late. It's not too bad. Uh, let's close up the doors. And we are away. Twenty miles per hour on the speed limit. Try and keep that in check. Got one point seven percent downgrade. Right, in a couple hundred yards we're gonna get thirty. Where is the station? 300 yards. Okay. There we go.
Right, Piccadilly Circus, platform two. I think we're needing the end, right? Fine. <clears throat> Doors unlocked, passengers are boarding. Close up the doors. Let's get the hell out of here. Charting Cross Platform 2. That was weird. Twenty-five, and then it's about to come down to twenty. Fine. Right, doors open. Come on, people. Alright, there we go. Close up them doors, get into there. I can literally see the next platform right in front of me. Uh, Bankment, platform six, okay. Just a short little hop, this one. Two embankment. It's got a downhill section, so... And the train is picking up speed on its own. I think we've actually gained time, which is phenomenal. Six hundred and fifty yards to Waterloo, platform four. Uh, it is actually right. There we go. There's the thirty. Before we can even get up to 35, uh, we're going to have to slow down again. True story. <laughs> yeah, what are we slowing down to? 25. God, it's a horrible noise that. <laughs> All right, get them doors open. Yeah, we're actually making up time here. I don't know how. We might actually make this on time, possibly. All right, off we go. Lambeth North, platform two. 
Ah, this is weird. There's external light source coming from somewhere. I can actually see some stuff here. Slowing down for that 25 that we're about to hit right now. 350 odd yards to the station. After the station though, we're going to get a speed limit back up to 30, so that's nice. Perfect. Doors open. And we're pretty close. We're like 10 seconds late there or something. Alright, way we go. Right, down to 20 there. I didn't even notice that. Coming down to 10 past this platform as well. But this is Elephant and Castle. So the next step should literally be to uh, park it up in the depot, right? I was just I was just thinking there whether this is the actual the actual end. Does it actually then go and tell me to stick it into London Road Depot? We'll continue on. That's what we'll do. We'll have a look and see what happens. Right. Doors are locked. Right. So that is the end of the scenario. Did we get a gold? Total score 25,228. Da-da-da-da-da. I don't think I did get gold because it normally comes up on the bottom right hand side of the screen there. Uh, actual, we did lose a lot of points because we were coming in late at a lot of places. Although Elephant and Castle due 0626, actual 0626. So we made it to the end anyway. Uh, where were we speeding? We had a couple of areas where we were speeding but nothing massive. Right, let's push E, continue. Right, I want to go to this, right? And then service is scheduled to start and wait for service. Ah, uh, okay. Right, we won't do that because I think that is continuing on uh, from Elephant and Castle to somewhere else. But we'll leave it there for that episode. As always, if you did like this and you would like to leave a like, comment, or dislike, Please feel free to do so, and if there's more you'd like to see in the future, then hit that subscribe button. But I've been Danny Men, this has been Train Sim World 2, and I will catch you later.